who you buy from yeah. is almost as or more important than what you buy. Yeah. And I don't believe, correct me if I'm wrong, Skinny, I don't believe anybody wakes up in the morning and goes, I think I'll go down to ABC, Chevrolet, Mazda, Mitsubishi, Volkswagen, Ford, Chrysler, and buy a vehicle. I don't believe <laughs> anybody wakes up and does that. But when they've done their research and they say, I think we'll, we'll drive from Huntsville to Sault Ste. Marie because we know there is a winter green or evergreen mm -hmm. Silverado there because Jeff said it's here. It's online. It's in stock. I sent him a message. He said it's here. It's online. And the other thing that we really need the audience to get skinny is that when we do this walk around presentation, that is one of the steps of the eight step sales process that moves them yeah. from a logical state of mind to an emotional state of mind. It doesn't mean that the walk around is gone. No. And correct me if I'm wrong, Skinny, we're seeing a ton of that right now because of scarcity and urgency, oh. primary buying act actions. People are like, yeah, I don't, I don't, I, we don't do the walk around anymore. Like it's, it's pointless. Like we got three. Well, it's great while well, we've got three, but do you think any one of our manufacturing leaders are going to rely on the fact that, yeah, we can't build enough product for you guys to have inventory in the ground. So you're always only going to have one or three. Yeah. It's going to change and it's going to change so fast. It'll be an overnight thing and we'll have tons of product and every, and every dealer will be shouting at the, at the sales team, like guys, move it like the 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 interest rate clock is ticking here like let's sell some product and 